What's up guys, this is PJ Alexander, and in this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use a weight scale at a truck stop. If you've ever visited a truck stop, such as a Pilot or a Loves, you've probably seen one of these. This is called a weight scale, and it's commonly used to verify the exact weight of the vehicle you're driving. These truck stop scales are available for drivers to use to verify the exact weight of their truck, whether loaded or unloaded. There is a fee to use these scales, but they are very simple to use. So what is their purpose exactly anyway? Well, one purpose weight scales serve is for shippers to know the exact weight of the product that they are shipping. For example, let's say you've been dispatched to pick up a load of scrap metal in a container. The shipper doesn't always know the weight of the scrap metal that they will be loading onto your truck. So they may ask you to go take your truck to a local weight scale to weigh your truck as it's empty. Once you arrive to the shipper and they finish loading your truck, you'll return back to the weight scale that you received your empty weight. Once on the scale, you'll be able to determine the amount of weight of scrap metal that was loaded onto your truck to communicate back to the shipper so that they know how much was loaded on your truck for record keeping and billing purposes. So you take the total gross weight of your truck after your second weight or your loaded weight and subtract that from the first weight or your unloaded weight from that amount. The difference will be the approximate weight of the actual product, or in this case, the scrap metal that was loaded onto your truck. All right, so let me demonstrate to you real quick how it's done. Here we go. All right, so uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna get on the scales and weigh this truck. I am empty, so I have nothing in the trailer right now. I'm about to go get loaded about eight minutes away down the road. But before I do that, I would like to see what my truck weighs to get an empty weight. And then when I come back after I'm loaded, I'm gonna weigh myself again to see how much product to put on my truck and how much it weighs. So we're gonna pull up to the scale here. Now you wanna keep your tires in between the front and back yellow line. Ease up like this, trailer's on in the back as well. Look in your mirror. Once we get to this post, I'm going to pull the parking brake and I'm going to turn the truck off. All right, so right here, what you're gonna have is you're gonna have a button, a button right here, and you're gonna press the button. When you press the button, the representative inside is gonna answer and they're gonna ask you if this is your first way or your second way. Right now I'm doing my first way because I haven't been loaded yet and I'm gonna come back to get my second weight. So this is my first weight. So we're gonna push the button. First way or rear way? This is the first way. What's your truck number? My truck number is BWE931. You can just put 931 on there if you want. All right, buddy, I got your light pulled everything inside. All right, thank you very much. So that's it for that. What we're gonna do is we're gonna pull up off of the scale, just like that. You pull my parking brake and we're gonna go inside. All right, so that was my first weight out there. BWE931, that's my truck, yep. Company is BWE. Trailer number is 21. All right, so I have the ticket here, and this is the first weight ticket. We're at 35,120 pounds. All right, let's go pick up this load. All right, so we're pulling in here to a place called Newlyweds Foods. Newlyweds, like getting married. And we're gonna get checked in here and get loaded. And then we'll head back over there to the scales at the pilot station and get a second weight. All right, let's get her done. The BOL says that I'm at 40,000 even, but uh, I don't think that's gonna be accurate. All right, well, we are headed back to the scale house there at the pilot station. We're gonna get our second weight on this truck. The original BOL that I received from the broker was about 41,000. 120 pounds gross weight. Well, when I looked on the BOL that I got from the actual shipper, it says that this is about 40,000 pounds even. So we really don't know. So we're gonna go back over to the scale house and we're gonna get an approximate weight for this load. So I'll see you over there. All right, so we're basically gonna be doing the same exact thing. We're gonna come around, swing out. We're gonna make sure that our trailer is straightened with our truck. I want to make sure that all 18 wheels are going to sit on the scale. Pull up real slow. Just make sure that all your wheels are within the yellow lines. And again, I'm going to turn my truck off. I'm going to pull the parking brake just so we can hear what's being said on the intercom. Push the button again. Ah! 
call at 481, may I help you? Yes, ma'am. This is my second wait. The number on the form on the bottom left-hand corner? All right, the number is 5307. Is this BWE? Yes, ma'am, it is. Okay, hold on, let me run it. I'd just like to confirm that I've got the right carrier on reway. Okay, I have you scaled. Come in at your convenience. Thank you so much. All right, so we got our second weight. Now we're gonna pull off of the scale, pull the parking brake, and let's go inside. All right, that's mine right there. Just gotta pay for it. That's the second one. I'm paying for the reway, yes, ma'am. Rewards card. All right, so we did the second weight, and looks like the gross weight on the whole truck is going to be 76,360 pounds. All right, so let's do some math. All right, we are at 76,360 pounds, gross weight of what we just did on our second weigh. So let's take that number and subtract the first weigh when the truck was empty. And that weight was 35,120 pounds. So right now we're at 41,240 gross pounds. That's how much our truck weighs. So when you compare the first weight to the second weight, the difference is 41,240 pounds. So the product that was loaded onto our truck weighs approximately 41,240 pounds. So that's how you know how much your product weighs. When you compare the first way when the truck was unloaded to the weight of the truck after the truck was loaded. As you can see, we can't always rely on the BOL or the bill of laden to be accurate. But in case you feel as though the weight of your truck isn't legal, you have the option to visit the nearest scale found at many of the truck stops across the U.S. That is, if you don't want to get stopped by the DOT and be fined for being overweight. All right, guys, well, that about covers it. I hope this video helped you to know a little bit more about trucking. And feel free to like and subscribe for more videos about the trucking industry. And as always, take care and God bless you.